credenza. Yeah. Did you look it up? Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. What was it? It's what you said. Hmm. Well, this song doesn't sound like a real word. It sounds like a, a real word. <laughs> 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 Back to Bob. We're sneaking through some darkness. That is this game and Kingdom Hearts in a nutshell. Darkness, 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 darkness. Light! Xehanort! <laughs> Little Nightmares is in the Kingdom Hearts universe. Confirmed. Yep. <laughs> New fan theory. That's a pretty nifty game theory. Just... This is ever again. again. This loading logo is really stupid because it's just like the psychic energy logo it's from the, Pokemon cards. No, that's the yeah. eye. That was the symbol of the eye. The oh, I got chat. So it's like the uh, guest star Ringo Starr, everybody. Yeah, the MCP or whatever. Their their version of their evil technology. Their aperture science. Yeah, it's the eye, just not evil. Oh, sick. This is like old Aperture in Portal 2. Yeah. Also, what this game is doing is really interesting with the, like, the Z-axis type thing. Well, not Z-axis, I guess. The Y-axis. The Y-axis. The X and Y-axis. Is that, like... Because, like, in Limbo and, like, inside, it's all one axis. Yeah. But, like, this, you, like, move up and down, and, like, they're actually, like... They're actually using it, like, right then. Yeah. Like, that's interesting. And you don't see that in a lot of games except for 3DS games. Yeah. Yeah. Which is why we mentioned in an earlier episode that this would make a great 3DS game. Yeah. Because they're meant to be playing 3D. We know how games work. <laughs> and I play a lot of 3DS games, so... And primarily... I've been playing with myself a lot. On my 3DS. <laughs> God, I feel your mind out of the gutter. It'd be cool if the 3DS could vibrate. Fuck, wouldn't it though? That's an unrelated thing to the you playing with yourself. Like, I didn't just think of that because it's like a sex toy, but like. Oh, that's. I thought that's what you meant by that. A, like, no, it'd be cool if it had like feedback, like for games. Like, that'd be like a rumble. Did you just lock yourself in a closet? Like Tom Cruise? Little Rainbow, you don't have to be in the closet. You sing about these issues. You know this. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Whoa. At least I didn't make an R. Kelly joke. Ooh. I'm growing as a person <laughs> by not making R. Kelly jokes. <laughs> I'm figure out what I did here. Uh, pull out the drawers, get on the desk. I don't think you can pull out the drawers. I think you can. Or just climb them, I guess. There's tea there. Have a sp have a cuppa. <laughs> oh, cool. Got some lights and illumination happening. All this noties up there. It's like, get milk and eggs tonight. I love you. Carolyn. <laughs> Next note. It's Carolyn's obituary. <laughs> Dude, some chin-ups. Little Rainbow's getting swole. <laughs> Arm day. <laughs> Those gains, though. <laughs> CrossFit Rainbow. <laughs> uh, so I do this thing called CrossFit? <laughs> Oh, man. God, is this an office for giants? Can't make that jump. <laughs> this fucker's got one table. What's in this closet, though? A oh, light. The light? The, it's like it's like the briefcase. Mm -hmm. from, oh, it's a whole other fucking room. That's what I thought at first. That's why I was trying to go that way. I don't think it was open at first. There's a big eye. Yeah, it is a big eye. If you flip it face up, you can look at your top five cards in your deck and rearrange them any way you want. Good joke. There you go. Good joke. That's Next time I'm trying to Jeff's not going to be alive. <laughs> uh, why are we looking at Ew, children? Ew, you can watch little kids in their bed. Just like it's in my like dream. It's pedophile vision. Oh, and it blinks to change to gnome channel. <laughs> gnome it's channel. It's showing you the different areas. Whoa, what's that creepy looking thing? Oh, I guess we'll never know. Whoa, there's a staircase. Whoa, there's a cracked mirror. With something moving on the left. That was... Shows you, like, what's to come. Oh. Hey, there's a little trap door there. Right. On right that there. thing you were standing on. That little, um, Jackfield panel. Uh, there's probably just a guy that comes out of it. 
if you can even interact with it. Doesn't look like it. Hmm. So there's another one too, isn't there? Hmm. Anyways. I like the way the little rainbow tiptoes around in the dark. It's pretty cute. It's pretty quiet. Kawaii Desu. Shut up, Jack. Go through the door. Can't. It's closed. Yeah, Open the door. How? I don't know. Hands. Is there a handle or anything? It doesn't look like it. Maybe go back to the room. Doesn't know me. Maybe he'll open the door. Yeah. Or just ignore everything we say. You know, the usual. You can't control the gnomes. They control you. Uh, okay. Oh, I thought the lights in this room were just off now. Well, remember those stairs where we were at? I think you need to go higher. Yep. So... Let's go check that out. So I guess that was and just... there's, like, a... shit stain all over the floor in this office. Yeah. Dude had to go, and he did not make it to the john in time. No. Just spewed all over it. Just like... John Kenny. Graham. I don't know who John Kenny is. <laughs> Fuck. Is John Kenny a person? I don't think so. <laughs> did I just make up somebody? Well, I mean, it's probably a lot of people. I don't know. You thought I made up Credenza, so... <laughs> credenza sounds like a Pokemon. <laughs> Yo, Credenza! <laughs> oh, at least I don't have to it's go It's like a big cupboard. Anymore. Credenza! And his drawers are all that's, shit. All that's in that other room is the, like the uh, visions of the future. So. Like the dresser from Beauty and the Beast that like punched the guy with her dressers. Yeah. She had sass. She was an independent white dresser and she don't need no man. Yeah, except in the new movie they gave her a husband. I never saw that. Oh, movie. it's pretty dumb. The new one, like the live action one. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, I never saw it either. No, no, no. Yeah. No. Okay, there, there you go. go. Hmm. Are you like the opposite of human beings, where if you close one eye, you suddenly get depth perception? <laughs> Maybe. That door is very Bioshock. Yeah. Well, this whole like. The Shit. nautical theme to yeah. it, I guess. Yeah. Why are we so zoomed out? Uh, oh. atmosphere. You can move the camera. Yeah. The light moves with you. Why can you go up there? Hmm. Jeff, you made you mentioning Bioshock to make me want to makes me want to play Bioshock. I love that game. It's a really cool game. Um. I have Bioshock Infinite, and I haven't finished it, but I liked it. It wasn't a bad game. I just preferred the first one more. Oh, totally. Like, the first one's so unique and actually super fun. Like, part of like the part of what made Bioshock, the first one, good was, like, the enclosed, under the water, like, in this, like, abandoned city, like, atmosphere. And then, yeah. like, they brought it to Bioshock Infinite, and it's not abandoned. It's, like, it's It's in, populated, like, yeah. It's populated. It's in the sky. Everything's open. It, they just made Bioshock into a shooter at that point. That's true. I was like, that's what I didn't like about uh, Bioshock Infinite. It was still a good game, but it's, like... It was just really cheap on Steam one day, and I bought it. Yeah. And it's... It, there's very few options when you play on a Mac, and so you kind of just take what you can get. Yeah. And I was like, hey, I never played this. I'm going to try it. Are we going to play Dress Up in this room? You gotta change out of your little raincoat and become little rainbow. Mm -hmm. Wear your coat of many colors. Have those giant slippers for like fucking Shaq's feet. Or the rocks. Or the rocks. Size fifteen. Feet. Size fifteen boot. I don't believe he has a sign. Size fifteen boot. Uh, he does. Nah. I also don't believe those are size fifteen. Those? Yeah. I don't know. They never said. Can you pick up those slippers and tell me what the size are? <laughs> you are nowhere near that. Why did you think that would work? I would have thought I could make the jump. <laughs> it's like on the other side of the room. What? That'd be like if you jumped from where you are right now to the TV. Yeah. I could do that. <laughs> you underestimate my jumping capabilities. What? Oh, I picked up the wrong Oh thing. my god. That wasn't, that was a game. Sure. Whenever you have to tell yourself to sleep at night. You're, you're still really far away. I almost made it the first time. No, you, you didn't. didn't. You have to jump higher than where you're landing. You're, like, jumping underneath it. That might be close enough. No. 
still not. Just push up against the wall. I'm holding the grab button, it's not grabbing. I think it's because it's sideways now. I think there's like a certain. <laughs> <laughs> you like walked over to the slipper and got it again. Yeah, that's not the game. That was you running to the <laughs> slipper and picking it up. <laughs> I think it's. I think the reason why it's like just grinding its face against the thing while you're trying to like grab it is because there's like certain areas where you can grab it. Yeah, it's. Oh, sick! A hideaway bed with straps on it. And a person, I'm assuming. It looks uh, like a, it looks like a big piece of it. bacon. It does look like a big piece of bacon. Oh, that's really cool. This looks like the borrowers or something. This room. Oh, there's like a Jalopy Joe arms guy on the in the picture. Jalopy Joe. That's his name. <laughs> that's his name. That I made up just now. Okay. So next time I turn about, uh, we're gonna continue to explore this little room with a uh, little rainbow.